You faced some criticism in recent weeks over your push to uh, defund the police. Um, the campaign records show that you spent roughly $70,000 on, on private security, and some critics say um, that move is hypocritical. Um, what's your response to those critics? They would rather I die? You would rather me die? Is that what you want to see? You want to see me die? You know, because that could be the alternative. So either I spent seventy thousand dollars on private security over the last few months, and I'm here standing, here standing now, and able to speak, able to help save eleven million people from being evicted, or I could possibly have a death attempt on my life. And we're also talking about the same exact people who say horrible things about me, who lie to get to, to build up their base. And then because they lie about me, I receive death threats. Now, they don't address the fact that I receive death threats after they go on air and say horrible things about me. But then they want to say, oh, but she wants she needs private security. I have private security because my body is worth being on this planet right now. I have private security because they, the white supremacist, racist narrative that they drive into this country, the fact that they don't care that this black woman that has put her life on the line, they can't match my energy, first of all. This black woman who's, who who's puts her life on the line, they don't care that, my, that I could be taken out of here. They actually probably are okay with that. But this is the thing. I won't let them get that off. You can't get that off. I'm going to make sure I have security because I know I have had attempts on my life and I have too much work to do. There are too many people that need help right now for me to, to allow that. So if I end up spending 200000 if I spend 10, 10, 10 more dollars on it, you know what? I get to be here to do the work. So suck it up and defunding the police has to happen. We need to defund the police and put that money into social safety nets because we're trying to save lives. What other what other occupation can do work that's out of their scope and still be propped up to do work that's out of their scope as a nurse i can't be the surgeon too you don't want me being your surgeon and i'm the nurse at what point do we pay police to be social workers no nah, we don't how do they get to be social workers so what i'm saying is you do your job let the people who are who um, have gone to school with a particular skill set do theirs. Neither the, defunding the police and being able to have security because because those same folks are causing it. It's two totally different things.